Hello and welcome. My name is Josh Clark and today we're going to talk about three steps to maximize your team performance or as I like to refer to it as three steps to help your promoters earn more. And isn't that always fun creating a win-win scenario for everyone. So first a suggestion. Before the end of the month, before your month resets, print out your sales volume report. Make sure you click on all levels, your whole team, print that out and set it aside. Now here's the first step. On the first of the month or as close to that date as possible, pick up the phone and congratulate everyone in your organization that earned a sales volume commission that month. And then you want to ask them if they know how to reach the next sales volume level and offer to put together a strategy, a plan to help them reach it. Reach it. Now here's a, here's a tip. Do not prejudge who is interested in earning that next sales volume level and who isn't. Too often we make that mistake. Or we look at the, their, their business and we say, you know what? They're not trying to build a business. They're simply just buying products for them and their family. But you know what? You never know. And, and first of all, doesn't everybody appreciate being recognized, being appreciated, being noticed for what they did? Of course. So there's no way to go wrong with this. And then now the second step to, to increasing, raising, your, your, your maximizing your team performance is to pick up the phone on the 15th of the month. So right there in the middle, and you want to, again, look over your sales volume report and call up and congratulate everyone on your team who is having a great month, who is close to earning that, who could reach that next sales volume level and offer to help them. Maybe it's tweaking the strategy they already had in place or maybe it's putting together a plan because now you realize, hey, this person could reach this next level and you help them put together a plan to do it. And then the third step is, on the 25th of the month, start picking up the phone and calling everyone in your team who is oh so close to earning that next sales volume letter level. Now, too often, here's what we do. We wait to the last day of the month, the very end of the month. Now, it's better to do it late than never, but why not back it up a little bit where there's still time to, again, do something about it instead of just placing an order? Not that there's anything wrong with that, but what if we could help them bring on new business and reach that next level at the same time? So, on the 25th, there's still time to plan events, to take action. Now, here's a couple of key words that I've discovered really work well when you're placing that call at the end of the month. And here's what you want to say. First, you want to call up, congratulate them on a great month, and let them know, hey, by the way, I don't want you to feel any pressure to do anything about this, but I notice you're close to earning this, this next commission level. And here's the key words, I'd rather you earn the commission than me. Now, those are, again, those are key words because it's letting them know that you care about them, you appreciate them, you're looking out for their best interest. And yes, you may earn less on their volume that month, but trust me, if you look out for your team and your organization, it'll come back to bless you, to benefit you in spades in the long run. In fact, in the not so long run, okay? So that's really key that the first of the month, the middle and the 25th. Now, here are a couple tips for helping them put together that strategy. Number one is, is obvious, help them plan a shake and learn and offer to help them do it if you're able to. And if not, you can show them how to do it or show them how to play a video and do it. And then another, another tip is you can show them how to share a sample packet with someone um, and how to invite them to watch an educational video, an educational resource. So in other words, you wanna show them, teach them, and maybe even share a video with them on the four-step inviting formula and the triple opt-in. So they can effectively share a sample, share a tool, resource, and then how to follow up. And if you do that, again, you, you're, gonna, you're gonna see your, your business begin to absolutely grow and you know, to the next level. You're gonna help everybody earn more and that creates a lot of excitement in your organization. All right, and then one, uh, one note to keep in mind. Before you start to place those calls, call your leaders and certainly the directors in your organization and let them know, hey, by the way, I'm getting ready to pick up the phone and call the people in my 
you know, in my personal or qualified team, and I wanna encourage you to do the same. And this does several things. One, it leads by example. Two, it creates camaraderie. It's fun to do things with other people. And uh, next thing you know, you'll be creating healthy habits in your entire organization, and it'll just, again, take off. And I can't, as you, I hope you just not only hear this, but you get out there and take action and do it. And then I look forward to recognizing you for your success. All right, take care and God bless.